In this video we're going to go over how to install the Arduino ID and how to connect your board to it. First if we go into your browser of choice and type in Arduino, then click on the official Arduino website which is www.arduino.cc. Then click on software. Then scroll down and in the download options click on Windows 10 or whatever system you are using. Then click on just download which will start downloading the ID. Once the download is complete you can click on it to launch the installer. When the installer pops up, click agree to agree to the terms and conditions, then click next, then click install. This will now install the ID, it may take a while. Once it has installed, click finish and launch the ID. On the pop-up screen click on Allow Access. When it first launches, you will see in the output at the bottom of the screen that it is downloading and installing packages. Let this run until all downloads are complete. You may get a few pop-ups that ask whether you want to install the software for the USB drivers etc. Click Install. Now that the ID is installed successfully, Plug the Arduino into your USB connection cable and then plug it into your computer. A light should now turn on on your Arduino. Now if you go back to the IDE, under Select Board, you should see your Arduino. My version of Arduino is Arduino Uno. You can just select this from the list. If you don't have this option, then we can go to Tools, then Select Board then Arduino AVR board, then select your Arduino model from the list. We also now need to select the COM port by going to Tools, Port, and select the correct port from the list. Here mine is COM port 3. If you don't know which COM port to choose, then we can check if you unplug your Arduino from the computer. Then go back to Tools and Port. Notice how there is one port missing, which in my case is COM 3. If we plug the Arduino back in, then go back to Tools and Port. The COM port that our Arduino is connected to should now appear and we can select it. We can now use our Arduino and upload scripts to it. If we go to File, then Examples, then Basics, then click Blink, this will open up a script. We can then press the Upload button to upload the script to our Arduino board. It will then compile the code and upload it to our board. Now if we look at our Arduino again, it should have a blinking light. This concludes the video on how to install the Arduino IDE and connect our board to it. Stay tuned for more Arduino content.